Ladies, uh, gentlemen, thank you again, of course, for uh, coming to the Highlanders briefing, which is um, every Thursday. We, we, we thank you for continuously um, affording us uh, the opportunity to to speak to our fans um, and, and to speak to the, our partners out there. Um, importantly, I suppose we initially want to say thank you very much to our fans. Um, who, who came in, um, in very substantial numbers uh, at the last game, um, the first game of the season. It was a very important game of the season, um, infrastructure in terms of fan development and the things that we, we try and do. Um, well, importantly, the fans uh, not only came in their numbers, but um, behaved in a way that is uh, what we would like to see Highlanders behave in life. The, the way that uh, we want the, the value proposition to, to, to be. Um, so when people are at home and they think about Highlanders or in their offices, they think about Highlanders. That is the picture that we saw on Sunday. That is the picture that we want them to, 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 to imagine in their heads. Fans that are solidly behind their team, um, even when the team is, um, is not maybe playing um, at the at the tempo that at that particular moment they think they should be playing it, but standing and pushing behind the team that that was um, applauded. Also, even when there are decisions that they don't agree with, that they then don't um, throw missiles, that they are they are their vociferous expression of discontent is good enough uh, to to be heard. So we we are thankful that we we are having this continuous um, interaction with fans and they are. They are, they are responding in a way that is absolutely help, helpful for, for, for brand Highlanders and for brand football Zimbabwe. So, Siali Wong and um, and that is how we want to, 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 to shape up and look as, as, we, as we go forward into the season. We obviously are thankful to, to, to the media for, for covering our activities the way you have. It has contributed a lot to the response that we're having at the, at the stadium. So thank you very much for that. Um, so this is in a start, ladies and gentlemen, and uh, we, as we said, we uh, registered all players, but, but one, well, we've done our bit on one end, we're waiting for the completion of, of the registration of, um, of, of the links, um, as, is, um, as, is, uh, as is called, um, Patrick Ben Musaka. We are waiting for his um, reverse um, transfer certificate from from Safa. Hopefully, that is going to be done uh, before the, the game on, on on Sunday. But otherwise, outside that, our squad is um, is done. Um, there is not going to be any more additions. Um, if the coaches want to do that, that is the possibility comes up again at, um, at at the at the at the second window. So so for now, what you see. Is, is what 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 you get. Um, again, you are invited to to attend our training sessions where where, where you feel you want to, uh, and um, you you can always collaborate and liaise with with the office. Administratively, you all know that we are in the process of fulfilling the dictates and desires and requirements of club licensing. We are in the process of. Um, going through the applications and CVs for the, the position of um, um, security um, officer, uh, which person is going to really be the heartbeat of the organization uh, of the match day in terms of security, in terms of, in terms of inter interaction with fans, in terms of um, making sure that uh, we don't have any negative spillovers. Um, but also the, the media media officer who is going to be very important, especially in your in your in your space. Um, they'll be interacting with you much much more often. Um, they'll be one of you in any case, and um, we we hope that that is going to improve the the, the location of the brand uh, in the market, and that it will increase uh, the, our, um, our our <coughs> communication. With yourselves of course with uh, with the community at, at large so so we are there uh, the 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 announcements of course will be made when the the human resources process are, are, are done you will appreciate of course that um, that that process is a is a is a boardroom behind the scenes um, process um, 
so we won't be talking much about it so don't ask us about who is on the short list and who is not who applied who didn't we are not going to talk to that it's uh, the, the very professional side of how we do things so we are not going to share that that kind of information but we'll share um the, the final uh, names of uh, who has been uh, um, brought on board we obviously travel to harare um this this um this weekend to to play um, our second, our second, our second great game against the Um So we, we of course invite our fans in their numbers to, to, you know, to root behind, root for the team and stand behind the team and walk with the team through all the processes. It is always helpful for the fans to be there. But it's also important not only for brand Highlanders to be everywhere, to be seen everywhere. But it's important <coughs> for brand PSL. It's important for brand Zimbabwean football. So we, we have always been. The, at the very at the very apex of um, the contributors to the numbers at the stadium. So we want to play our part again this year in adding in the carnival kind of, um, atmosphere at, at, at uh, stadium. So we invite the fans to, to come in their numbers to to, to help grow this this brand uh, football in, in, in our country, um, which of course goes beyond Highland. Um, so so outside that there is. Um, you know, a few other things that we're doing, talking about that might not, you know, say too much about them now.